Indian homemade science, I'd like to show you a diving bear. It's a good summer project. It's something you can do inside or outside. Uh, they're simple to build, and it's a good lesson in buoyancy. They're similar to the Cartesian divers, so let's take a closer look. First, let's take a look at a Cartesian diver. Here's a sealed soda bottle with a little dropper inside, and as I squeeze the bottle, we see the dropper sink to the bottom, and as I release it, it goes back to the top. Now if we look very closely at that dropper, we'll see a bubble inside. When I squeeze the bottle, the bubble gets smaller, the dropper gets heavier, and it sinks to the bottom. When I release the bottle, the bubble gets larger, it becomes lighter, and then it floats towards the top. Now let's take a look at a diving bear. We need a large container filled with water. We could use an aquarium or a large bucket. In this case, I have this plastic tube, and it's filled most of the way. And so to use this, we're simply going to put him in here. Now the bear is filled with water, so he's going to sink down to the bottom of the container. Now to bring him back up again, all I have to do is squeeze the other bottle and up he comes. If you have access to a swimming pool, you could try the bear outside. We've had the bear dive deeper than 20 feet and then come back to the surface simply by squeezing the bottle. Here we can see a close-up of what's actually happening inside the bear. Squeezing the bottle forces air down into the bear. That air bubble makes him light enough that he goes to the surface. When I release it, the air comes out of the bear, he gets heavy, so he starts to sink. Now to make this diver, you need a small bottle with a hole in the bottom of it. Uh, the next step is to add some weights to it. It could be little marbles or stones or pennies, anything that's going to make it heavy enough to sink. Now the cap also has a hole in it. It's a 3 16 inch hole, and the tubing is quarter inch, so it's going to be a nice tight fit. That's going to keep it airtight the cap on the diver. The cap on the soda bottle also has a 3 16 inch hole. The other end of the hose is forced into that hole and get it in here. Now we're all set to go. Hey I hope you liked my video and thanks for watching. Bye!